Today, I'm gonna be fishing with my barber. Yo, Rob. Hey, Mike, what's up, man? Nothing much, How's man. How's it going? How you been? You ready to do some fishing? Absolutely. When are we going? We're going right now, man. You right ready? Right now? I'm yeah. ready. Let's do it. Last time I was here, Rob mentioned he liked fishing, so had to invite him, had to invite him out to do a little trout fish, and we do a little contest today. 1v1? Right. One? Okay. You think you can take me down? I don't know. We'll try. And I don't know if you can tell, I lost, I kind of lost the bet. Had to uh, dye my hair a little bit. Oh yep. my god. Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> I was wondering if you could uh, get my swag going a little bit, get a little gel going. I want to be looking good when I'm catching these trout. Think we can do that real quick? Absolutely. There you go. All right, so what's the plan today? So we're gonna go we're gonna me be, against you. Yep, we're fishing a river. You ready to do some hiking? We got a little bit of hiking going on. How far? Uh, we, I mean, driving is eight minutes and probably like a mile, maybe a mile hiking. Okay. And then we're just gonna fish, uh, we're going down the river and we're gonna fish all the way back up. All right. Oh, you're a pro. Sounds good. How long have you been running the uh, number one barbershop in Maryland? Ah, so we've been here 16 years. 16 years. 16. All right, guys, I think we're ready to, uh, Go slay some chowden. Right. If you need best haircut ever, come to Rob's Barbershop in Ellicott City, Maryland. All the barbers here are fantastic. They will take care of you. Thank you, thank Ready, you. Ready, dude? Thank you, let's do it. All right, we made it to the river. And Rob, you came prepared, man. Well, you know, you never know what you're gonna need, so it's a long ride back home. Oh, those are perfect. Yep. What kind of tackle did you bring here? Fly fishing gear, huh? Fly fishing. Fly fishing, all right. When's the last time you caught a fish on fly fishing? You know what? So I recently just started. Oh, you so recently started. So have, you caught a, have you caught a fish? Fly on fishing? the fly, no. No, you have not caught one yet. No. Today will be the first day. That's yeah. gonna be awesome. Yeah. So really, a lot of it's been I was just been practicing uh -huh. with it and using it, but I haven't actually went fishing, fishing. Oh, okay, so this will be your first time. Yeah. Well, this will be a, this will be pretty fun. Oh, right, there's a new goal. It's not gonna be a challenge because he's never caught one. We're gonna try to no, get Rob. No, doesn't matter. On we his first it. ever fly fish. That's what, that's our goal for today. Okay. That's we'll get cool. one. So Rob's not only a genius at cutting hair, he is a genius when it comes to fishing. He brought duct tape to tape down his pants. That's pretty smart, man. Yeah, because otherwise they ride up. Yeah, you don't want that's uncomfortable. When you put your waders on. So that's right. simple. I've never done that before too. This is the first time I've seen it. A simple fix with some duct tape. So what kind of flies are you gonna be throwing? Wet flies, dry flies? They're gonna be dry. Okay. You I'm gonna plans? try a couple different things today. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not giving up all my secrets yet. Oh, okay. Oh, got some secrets. <laughs> I like it. I might have underestimated my barber's fishing skills. I'm not gonna lie. All right, I'm about to gear up right here, and one small problem: the waders that I have, unfortunately, have holes in them. But I got it figured out. So you're gonna be waterlogged, is what you're no, saying? No, no, no. A small hole. It's a small leak. It's not too bad. Well, here's what we're gonna do, guys. We're going to we go with the old water. We go with the old trash bag trick. I'm gonna go ahead and tie on some trash bags. I'm gonna try to cut off my circulation here. This should work out pretty decent, I think. Now we got a, a good amount of hiking to do. About to get our workout in for the day. What weight fly rod is that? It's um, you know, it's kind of like a just a generic uh, probably just an all-purpose rod. Yeah, it's an all-purpose rod. One that you know, I wanted one I could break down. Rob's geared up. On the fly rod, what are you fishing with over here? A woolly bugger. Olive woolly bugger today. I've actually heard that's of that. That's we're going to try. That's a classic. That's a pretty classic fly. That is a pretty I've classic. heard of that. Cool. All right, good luck, man. We'll see. see on the around. river, spot number one, we're going to fish here, and we're going to fish all the way back up to the dam and try to find some trout. Oh, there's one. Oh! Trout number one. Did you get one. I got one. Right from that tree. Hey, do you want to eat him? Yeah. All right, we're keeping him. All right, so we don't need to practice safe trout handling here. We're just going to land this guy. Trout number one. Oh, don't. Come here, buddy. Got him. There we go. Who hooked him perfectly on this little spinner. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, yeah. How are we going to keep him, though? Do you have a bag? Yeah. This guy's actually been caught before. Huh? This guy's got been caught before, but today is not gonna be his lucky day. Oh, he's awesome. Oh yeah, this is a good this will be a good little eating size oh, for that's you, man. Good. Yeah. How are you gonna cook it? I like it. How do you like cooking these guys? I'll just grill them. That fish was hanging out right where it's supposed to be. This is the first deep hole that I fished since we started. 
down that way was way too shallow. What the heck is this? Yeah, check what is this, guys? That is an interesting uh, piece of trash I found here. Really heavy, probably about 30 pounds. Is it some kind of anchor? It's weird shape. Guys, comment below what you think that is. Right, it's been two and a half hours. We have not had very much luck. Even my Old Faithful honey hole has not produced even one fish. So Rob and I are about to go up to the dam and there's usually always fish here. The question is whether or not we'll be able to get them to bite. Oh, I got one, I got one. Oh, oh he's on. No! He got off. Dang it, dude. Oh my gosh. That's why you gotta wash your line, guys. Had him. Ooh, all right, so uh, what's your name, man? JP. JP? What's going on, dude? So we got JP, one of my subs. What's going on? Rob and I have been struggling. JP says he knows where the hot spot is. It's not too far. It's about 10 minutes away. Uh, it's a little bit of a hike, about five minutes. But uh, last week, got two smallmouth, three trout, and all in spinner baits. And weird, weird fact, it actually hit on a power bait, too, and a uh, smallmouth. Small is a power bait. That sounds pretty good. We're going to check it out. Hopefully, he can save the day, because I have not been doing a good job getting my barber <laughs> on fish today. Uh, we're gonna see how my uh, how my bag trick worked over here. Ah. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! You're not so... looking not looking too dry right now. So my bag trick didn't quite work out, but not too big a deal. Feet's a little wet, but I'll live. <laughs> it's worth it to catch fish. All right, so we're on the road. We're following JP. We're taking this secret passage. Where are we going, man? We're going to Narnia. Going to Narnia, all right. All right, we made it. The secret waterfall right here. Oh, we need to get down there somehow. Follow these guys. I'll be good. With the rod? Yeah, I'll be good. Oh, rock coming down. Oh. <laughs> oh, scared. Oh! Right in the hole. Almost. Almost, we good? I'm good. Oh man, we're right here. Dang. There's a waterfall. It's probably cool. That's cool spot, stuff. right? Yeah. Let's see if we can catch anything. Oh, I think we're going to have some good luck on our side. I'm, I got to hit that side, man. I'm going in. How deep is it right here? Oh, uh, you better bet. Right here. Walk this path right here, yeah. Yeah. How deep does it get? Right. Right here. Right here? Yeah. Right, I can do it. It's going to be a little chilly, but not too big. A little slippery too. A little slippery too? Yeah. What do you think about it? Should I do it? Got to go with the fish are, right? Okay. I'll go in. Let's see how cold it is. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Woo! That's chilly. Woo! Damn. This is some chilly water, guys. 53 degree water. All right, we good. We made it. Oh, he got one. He got one. Dang. Oh, I gotta check this fish out. I'm going back over. Oh, Jesus. Dude, that's freaking slippery. Dang, that's cold. Nice, dude. Oh, dude, that's a big one. On the rooster tail, huh? Oh, he's getting all over me right now. Yeah, I got a bag for Rob. Throw him in there, man. There we go. Good stuff, good stuff. Good that job. only took like 10 minutes. You got one. <laughs> That's See, literally got a cast ready to get the water by. I dropped it down for like two seconds. Nailed it. Oh, dang. There's one. I got one. First cast. Oh! He got off. I had one though. Yeah, I had one. Good bite. There he is. Got him. Dang it, dude. I got a bluegill. On my first fish at the secret dam, a freaking little, what is this? Green sunfish? I don't know. I'm getting bites on the pink worm, but I'm trying to land some of these quality trout. Uh, I'm going back in the water. I need to pull out the forbidden bait. I just want to catch some fish. All right, trout, I know you're in there. It's time to meet your maker, power bait. There's no way you can resist that. Oh, dude, you got another one. What is that? What is that? JP crushing the trout. Where'd you get that one on? 
Uh oh. Oh! A little pink worm over here. I recognize that bait. <laughs> Dang, nice dude. Nice dude. Little baby, but I'll take it. Dude, good stuff. You're crushing it. Heck yeah, man. Alright, now I gotta go back to my post. I gotta try to catch one of these trout. Let's see how cold this water is. I wanna get one trout. The water temp is... Holy... It's a... Uh, water temp 48. I'm only going in that one more time, guys. I'm freaking freezing in this water. This is nuts. Last time going in the frigid water. Here we go. Ooh. I thought I was gonna get used to going in now, but every time I go in, it's like... It's freaking biting me. You definitely don't want to go waist high on this. Cause whoa, 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 whoa. Cause certain body parts are not gonna feel very good. Last cast right here. I'm getting extremely cold. I can't feel anything from the uh, knee down. This is officially the coldest water I've ever waded in. So we're about to call a day at the secret waterfall. I'd like to give a big thanks to JP for bringing us out here, man. No problem, man. That was no awesome. Problem. So usually the fish is a little bit better here, right? Oh, uh, it's a lot better. Today is a bit cold. It is uh, a bit cold. Yeah. The water, especially the water, is really cold. <laughs> but, but, uh, hey, you, you caught that nice fish. You caught yeah. a nice about 15, 16 inch rainbow. I didn't let you down, so I'm happy with that. Yeah, that was awesome. <laughs> Good stuff again, man. And Rob, sorry I couldn't get you any fish today, man. Man, it was awesome. Any day fishing is a good day. Hey, that's true. Any day we get out, you know, enjoy the great outdoors. Any day. Every day fishing is a good and, day. And uh, you're going to have a nice little treat for dinner. Yeah, that'll be awesome. Thanks for coming good. out, man. Good to go. All right, let's take a look at this bad boy. JP's, JP's trout. There he is. He looks good. Bigger. He does Where's look good. I'll give you uh, that. No, no, no. They're about Jenny. the same. They're about the same size. They're big. Yeah. Yeah. Looks good. Is that, tonight? Is that going to be dinner for you tonight, That's Rob? That's going to be dinner. We are coming down. <laughs>